Hello my YouTube fam. Today I'm bringing you a video about decorating home decor. And what I'm decorating today is my vincette. It's between my dining room and my kitchen. And this is what it looks like. And that's me in the mirror. Uh, so today we're going to do a DIY project with, um, you know, just an added decoration to um, the vincette table. Okay, so the DIY project I'm talking about is sort of like a candle. And what you're going to need is some basic um, supplies that you may have at home or you can pick it up at the dollar store. This here has already been assembled, but all it is is a can, a jar of, um, it was a jar used for spaghetti sauce or some type of sauce. And at the dollar store, I picked up this candle uh, stick holder and I adhered it uh, together with some glue the strongest glue possible I can't think of the name of that glue that I use but it holds it very well and originally I used it for a uh, it held candy for my daughter's birthday party so you're going to need that you're going to need a glue gun and glue stick you're going to need these vinyl what are called wall creation stickers that you can reassemble and, and you can get that from the dollar store. You're going to also need some twine, some rocks, sand, and a candle. Whatever kind you prefer, wherever you choose to pick it up, whatever size that you uh, choose to use. And I'll be back with the tutorial. So what I am doing here is taking the glue gun and I'm putting, can you see anything? putting dabs of glue around the base of the glass or the candelabra and then I'm pressing it on as such like that and I'm just spinning it around I still have it attached to the um, spool and I'm just dabbing glue hot glue you can see that around and pushing it pushing it that's what I'm doing so I'll be back when I'm done with this so I'm back just to update I'm still uh, continuing to wrap the twine around the base of the jar um, this is going to be the most tedious part of this, this tutorial, so it's going to take some time. But just take your time, go slow, and um, it should come out fine. So I'm done with the base of the candle, but I've decided to take uh, the twine up into the stem area. Uh, it's up to you how far you would like to go. You can stop just at the base, or you can continue on up the stem as uh, I am choosing to do. So, uh, and that's, you know what, really is the most tedious part because it's so many small areas and it's a not, it's not a smooth surface. It's so many intricate cuts here. So, like I said before, just take your time and it, uh, it'll happen. Now, it's taken me about 30 minutes already to do this. So, this total project probably will be a whole hour just for the base and the stem because of the, t the twine I decided to select. So, it's very thin and it's cheap. I see a lot of little, you know, r raggedy edges, um, fraying or whatever. But I'm going to find a way to get rid of that. But, um, you know, just keep following me and I'll be back. Okay, so <clears throat> we've finished uh, putting the twine on the bottom base. And now what I'm doing is taking the wall decals that I got from the dollar store. And I am placing it on the candelabra see there and it you don't have to worry about placing it and not liking it because these are removable and replaceable so you can take them up as often as you like so when I'm finished with the complete project I okay will so now I've added the rocks and the sand into it to the candelabra and the final touch is putting the candle inside and then that'll be it and there will be pictures following so I hope you enjoyed this tutorial 
Thank you for watching.